I'm Tosh Roskai, uh, born in San Francisco, raised in Milwaukee. I'm Mo Harmon, born in Detroit, uh, live here in Atlanta. I'm Jack Curry, I grew up in Belize and lived in New Orleans. Did you know that this was going to be 3D printed? It was set up very clearly from the beginning as an additive manufacturing process. Through additive manufacturing and 3D printing, you can get complexity for no additional costs, basically. It's really just material. So the idea of creating a lightweight, high-performance uh, piece that, that can reduce material where you don't need it, add material where it does need it, um, while creating something aesthetically pleasing the whole time was definitely in our interest. I think one thing was really important for us too in, in our product was to, to tap into a culture that was local and in, in California and knowing the history of the historical precedent of skateboarding in California. Through software we can control things like gradiated concentrations of density, porosity, as well as the shaping of the, of the underside. So you've got something that's totally flat on the top, but on the bottom you can see grooves. There is kind of this like removed yet very relatable process where we're still kind of hands-on molding and shaping the board. Plywood boards are made with layers, like often seven layers, and we took that same layering process and applied it to this digitally. So we create different layers that got stacked um, in the computer. One thing uh, we do have our school is a 3D printing process that is mainly used for representation and not taking advantage of the manufacturing process. And so I think what we're extremely excited about this is that um, this is the actual product. Mm -hmm.